Hi there, I'm Marcel from Street Racket. I want to show you how you can use the Street Racket concept to be active at home with your family. All you need is a spongy soft ball, a racket, original racket, or you use your hands or even a school book to hit the ball. And then if you want to play on the courts, you put three squares on the ground. One, two, three. We usually mark an X in the middle one because this sort of replaces the net and you play over it. One bounce in between hits every time and no down play. The size of the court doesn't matter at all. We recommend using two by two meter squares, but you can make it smaller. It adapts to any surface or any space that you find outside your home or inside. If you want to know more about Street Racket and the many ways of playing, um, we have a free app, streetracket.app. It's also available in the Apple and Android store. You'll find plenty of ideas there. Once you're set up with your court and you've drawn the three squares on the ground, make sure to follow the basic rules of Street Racket, which are also the heart of the concept. No volleying, no downplaying and no smash. We have no net in the middle, so there's no height restriction. So we have to make sure the ball goes in an upward movement towards the other side. This results in very nice and rhythmic uh, rallies uh, where we do a lot of exercise and we can really work on our motor skills. So long rallies, control, maybe a bit of cleverness is the key to the game. We're going to do a little race with the racket and the ball around the court. Ready, set, go! Los! <laughs> We have found a new way of using your school books for sports and fun. So take your school books, replace the racket with your books. Let's go, kids. A lot of very exciting ways of playing or of uh, motor skill training can take place outside the street racket courts on any open space or area indoors or outdoors. Also it's very important to follow the basic rules of street racket which are the heart of the concept. No volley, no downplay. We want 
cool rallies, long rallies and uh, good feeling. We can do little games in mathematics, such as additions or subtractions or multiplication. Let's see how that goes. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, four, and two is six, four, and four. Is eight. Five times two is ten. Four times three is twelve. There are also a lot of cool games to work on your language skills, to include language training in the concept, spelling of words, make up rhymes, make up stories. It makes a lot of sense to work on your language skills like that because with the exercise we get extra oxygen flowing through our brain and we can use it to more of its usual capacity plus of course it's a lot of fun to uh, work like that s k y sky d o t do rat Bat. frog dog Tree. Bee. Mouse. House. Fall. Ball. Sky. I. <laughs> In the next exercise, the kids are going to describe a word and they're giving hints hit by hit. And I will try to find out if I get the word right. Roof. Door. Window. I think it's a house. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Leaves. Branch. Trunk. It's a tree. Yes. Yeah. Air. Clouds. Blue. The sky. Yes. We can also tell each other a little story, word by word and hit by hit. Today. We play street racket! So the easiest way and the quickest way to make the chords is just using chalk on the ground. You can also use normal masking tape like this and especially for indoor use have the chords ready in a matter of seconds. This is also very uh, nice. Have a look at this. If I put the corners on the ground like that I can just do the outline of a street racket court in a few seconds and you're ready to go. You can make the chalk yourself like we did uh, yesterday. So my son here, he made all these pieces of chalk with different colors. There's a train, a rabbit, a little cake. And you can use the chalk to mark your chords. All you need is a bit of um, ingredients that you find on YouTube. Just uh, Google, make your own chalk. All right, have fun playing and being creative. Okay, <laughs> 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 <laughs>